Okay, this time with the oscilloscope probe removed and monitoring temperature of TVS diode 24 volts that's to see if the temperature, I mean if the oscilloscope probe could be causing some of the spikes which could then be causing the TVS diode to conduct alright let's, let's look at the current here and I'll be talking. Okay, so the heat spreader temp or the temperature of the probe is currently at 228, 229. And also, I've got it in a bucket of water this time, which is kind of different, but I don't know what that'll do. So, 7 amps, 7, 15, 19, 21, 22. 23. Maybe I should let it heat up a little bit just to kind of. I don't know. <laughs> Temperature at 30, 231, 232, 233. Huh. It's climbing up just kind of like before. Okay. Two thirty five, two thirty six, two thirty seven. Could be that it's sitting right on top of the bus bar, maybe. And maybe the bus bar is warming up slightly. Okay, so twenty three amps, thirty. 40, 240, 241, hmm. I don't know what I'm going to see here really, 50 amps, 245, 60 amps, 247, 248, 50 amps, 70 amps, 80, 90, freaking me out, dude. 100, 10, 20, 40, 150, 152 is the peak. <sighs> Nothing blew up, so that's good. Heat spreader temperature 295, 296, 297, 299, 300, 301, 302, 303, 304, 305. Wow. 306, 307, 308. Okay. Yeah. We just arrived at a result here. <laughs> That, that heat spreader temperature was climbing quickly. Oh, that's very interesting. Okay, TVS diode temperature monitoring time again. <sighs> Freaks me out when I do this. Okay. <clears throat> Six amps, so 258. Well, so six amps, 40, well, <laughs> 42 amps. Maybe I should watch the current. So 258, 259, 
holding at 259, 260. Okay, 73 amps, 262, 262, wow, not yet. Holding it, and then 263, 80. Let's just crank it up and see how bad it gets. 100, 267, 268. All right, let's just crank it all the way up. 273, sheesh. Disturbing. 277, See, its temperature is still climbing after I turned it down. The 310, 311. 